All right. I ain't going to take too long. I'm not going to take your time. But there are things that I need to explain. I was working on this project right now for my videos. And I seen an email that I can't ignore. Because this email, it reminds me what I went through when I started my spiritual journey. It says right here that, Hey, the mind is the altar. I need your help. I'm freaking out. It's been four weeks since I started my spirituality journey. And now, sometimes I just feel like crying. Sometimes I feel happy and sad. And sometimes I lost time. Like, I don't know, I'm just spaced out. And I changed my diet. And I feel like me and nature are connected. I gotta be honest with you, man. A beautiful thing is happening to you because I've been there. And it can be very confusing if it is your first time. If for those who are just now awakening, or you know, for those who are just now are aware of their inner self and spirituality and the universe, it will hit you. 10 times harder if you was to do this like a couple years ago. Why? Because now we are in a new different type of energy. And I've seen a lot of people saying that we are in the sixth dimension. And for those who are vibrating in this sixth dimension, in this new energy right now, the symptoms, the signs can be very confusing. It's sleepless. You can't uh, focus. Sometimes you lose, you know, time. Like you're like, what was I going to do? I've heard people tell me that they had a, a light headache. Confusion a little bit and also moody. All these things are normal. If you feel like these things are increasing 100%, then check with your doctor first. But let me tell you right now, we are vibrating on a new uh, energy right now. For those who are spirituality will tell you and they will feel this. And for Even if you are not in a spiritual path, you can still feel this, but you will dismiss these feelings. You will dismiss this energy that you feel when you walk outside your house because you don't understand. Since 2020, how many things have been revealed from the government, from Earth, uh, you know, from spirituality to the you know spirit realm, everything has been revealed, uh, revealing since 2020. Excuse me. And there's a reason why that's happening. We're not living in third dimension anymore. We're not hiding underneath underneath the blanket. Even those who didn't believe in you know being aware. Of lifting the veil of this reality and now are aware and you know what they call it right now oh it's just a conspiracy theory or it's just something people want to do no everybody is becoming aware because this is the energy that we are on right now the universe is trying to balance itself but we can't balance ourselves without revealing what's really what the problem is and now Everything that's built in a lie is revealing itself from the government, from all this crap that you see that's going on. You sit there, you're like just shaking your head. You're like, are they really pushing this? Because it's about that time for the truth in this universe and also for balance. Somebody told me that this is uh, there's a war going on in spirit realm right now. Believe it or not, there's been a war going on to in the spirit realm to protect itself. <laughs> it's more like we now we're gonna wear the mask but their masks are coming out. So right now let me tell you something what's happening to you. Sorry I got carried away over there. When you experiencing this uh, feelings you can call it spirituality depression right? A lot of people think 
when you are aware, you know, when you are on a spiritual path, when you become aware, see how I'm avoiding the word awake? Because if you're awake, I think you will quit your job. If you had thought I was open, you will, quit, you will quit your job because this reality, it will be like it won't exist in your life. So right now, you are saying that, you know, you're freaking out. The only thing is happening right now is you were blinded before. You were using your eyes, but you were using your eyes for things that are very comfortable and are very familiar with you but when your mind when your brain is introduced to the unknown things get very uncomfortable and your mind right now is trying to figure out what's really going on because it cannot recalculate on what's going on it's like lifting the veil right you are not under the blanket anymore you just open up your window and just looking a little bit seeing the reality of this so-called reality so your mind is so busy trying to make sense of the real reality because it's used to the old programmed reality right there goes confusion and dizziness because now your frequency you're not you're not the same you anymore you have vibrant on a higher frequency and now this can cause fear and there you go it goes to depression spirituality depression see someone before I told me that they thought I was too open they can't sleep I'm familiar with that don't let nobody tell you that they thought I always open because sometimes they thought I can be open only for like a night or something because if you if you can balance you thought I've been open then you can have it open all the time you thought I sometimes open by accident and then you're like whoa what did I see? What was that? It don't happen all the time. You thought I cannot be open all the time because unless you're good at balancing it. So somebody told me they thought I is too open to when they go to bed, they close their eyes. They can still see their ceilings. They see, uh, uh, they can still see their ceilings and they see stuff, you know, that they they just want to break. So you got to balance. So, What's going on with you, my friend? You need a balance. You need a grounding. Everybody works different. Though. I don't know how you want to, how you ground yourself, but you need to ground yourself. Some people, they ground themselves by walking out in the forest or having uh, crystal stones. They carry crystal stones with them or meditate or just do a little prayer and ask for your guidance or God, whoever you believe in, to bring balance in your life on what, you, what you're seeing right now because this is new to you. So, for those who are in a spiritual journey right now, a lot will be revealed to you. My advice is be ready and be prepared. And most of it right now that on this, we have vibrating on this frequency, we will experience a lot of energy, negative, positive, you name it. A balance is needed. Thank you for being with the Mind is the Altar. We'll talk to you soon. And feel free to hit the like button. And also feel free to subscribe to support the Mind is the Altar. You are a beautiful soul. Have a good weekend.